the team and welcome back along to the Sam Lewis Beer Pro Career here on your home of rugby. Today's episode, well, a little, a little bit down key. I've just recorded the final and I tell you what, man, woo, what a game, what a performance, what a season. It's been a long one, but it has been absolutely incredible. Today, we are just looking forward to season number five. Do we move? Do we stay? Do we re-sign somewhere else? Do we finish this season here at the Crusaders, then move overseas? There's a lot to discuss, and there's a lot to go over. So first things first, if you're new around here, if you've not seen what we're developing, this is a little bit of a look at the man himself, Sam Lewis, as we head into our fifth season here with the big giant South African number eight. We have just, spoiler alert, one the Rugby World Cup to go along with a plethora of other trophies alongside those. This is the man we are determining the fate for. And the clubs, well, let's not mess about, shall we? Let's get straight into having a look at the teams who are interested, who are chomping at the bit to have a little piece of Sam Lewis. Of course, if you want to let me know who you think we should sign for, because, of course, remember, this is decided by you guys out there watching we will be having of course comments on this video and the previous one will obviously count for votes there will be a poll on the community tab of the channel as well which will count for votes you can message me on places like discord or even have a conversation of it throughout the discord channel which will be in the description if you want to join we can say we think mr lewis will go or should go next season now, do remember, we do have an outstanding contract with the Crusaders. So if we do choose to move overseas to, like, England or, of course, anywhere in the URC, that will mean we will still play out our time with the Crusaders throughout Super Rugby this season before moving on to take on whatever tournament we go to or league we go to from there. So keep that in mind. It might be a season full of Super Rugby antics before moving away overseas yet again, but that is just another option as we try and take on the whole world, equivalently. The whole world taking on Sam Lewis. Right, let's get into it and have a look at what teams want a piece of Mr. Lewis. Here we go. Advance our way through. And doo -doo 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 -doo. here we go. Right, let's dig into it straight off the top. We have got the New South Wales Waratahs in Super Rugby. Let's not... The Hurricanes have been right up there, top of the list of teams that want a piece of Sam Lewis all throughout our time with the Crusaders. So it's no surprise to see them up here with a top offer as well, 118,000, two years. Our Waratahs was three, and they're actually a better team. Uh, but we have won Super Rugby, and again, provided if we go to somewhere like Scarlets in the URC, we will have a chance to win a second Super Rugby title if we get to play the whole season. That is a big, big if there as well. But Scarlets have come in. Again, another max contract so far of 118,000. Two-year duration to go to the URC with the Welsh Scarlets side. Moving on, back to Super Rugby. The Queensland Reds also won a piece, of course. Remember, Super Rugby are teams we've already pummeled over the last year. So that's why these guys are more interested, because beating a team gives you a lot more interest than not beating a team, right? So if we go and beat up on the Reds, they are like, wow, this guy's incredible. Our, right, our liking is going to go up by 18 points rather than just 3 or 4. That's why we're seeing so many Super Rugby sides. But let's move on. The Reds, 3 years, 115,000. Here we go. France, top 14. 3 years, La Rochelle. Very good team, La Rochelle. We haven't beaten France. We haven't beaten the URC yet either, I think. Did we do a season? No, we didn't do a season in the URC. Um, we'll have to double check where we've actually been throughout all these years. Um, but of course, there is still... Plenty of tournaments to win. La Rochelle, 115k for three years. We've got plenty more than that, though. The Blues, of course. The Blues. Um, yeah, no. That, that would be a real traitorous move, wouldn't it? Crusaders, the Blues. Ouch. That is a real kick in the nuts, that one. Ooh, the Jaguares won a piece as well. Very good team. Best out of South Africa for all the years. Of course, we won Super Rugby with the Stormers as well, remember. So we have a very big trophy cabinet full of Super Rugby titles. Moving on. Oh, Premiership. Here we go. Northampton Saints. Three years there. 107,000. That would be a nice club to go to. What do you think about the Saints? Could be a good addition to go win ourselves a Premiership title. 
Who else we got? Toulon. Toulon. Okay. Top 14. Big money move to the French club of Toulon for three years. Cheetahs in the URC. Okay. That would be a bit more closer to home playing in the South African franchise. But we roll on from there. Highlanders and Super Rugby. Way down the list. Again, South Island franchise alongside the Crusaders. They're giving us 104000 for three years. We're not even halfway through the list yet. We've got... Oh, the Sail Sharks. Ooh, okay. A couple of nice URC teams. A couple of nice... Well, actually, only one URC team. Oh, the Cheetahs as well. We've got a couple of nice top 14 sides so far as well. And a couple of nice premiership teams for you guys to devour over as well. So, Sail Sharks, 104000 Really, money doesn't matter. Good team, 70 rated. Uh, let's see if we can do what they're doing this season. Actually, they're playing very well so far, are uh, the Sail Sharks. Ooh, another Zebra from the URC. So, Zebra could be a good shout. Two years, 104,000. Not a great team, but of course, we will definitely boost that racing up if we do jump on to the Zebra train. And the back of the Zebra, right? Let's be honest, it's a Zebra. Multicolored Zebra, too. Looks absolutely beautiful. 62 rated. Um, another option for the URC. Worcester. Well, we know they're not really here anymore, but they're still here on the game. And you know what? Screw it. We're rolling with it. Worcester Warriors. Premiership Rugby. 71 rated. Two years on 100. Spondulis splat flat in the face from Worcester. Moving through. Connets. Again, another URC. Struggling Connets side. 66 rated. 100,000 though to go join the Connet boys in the URC. Golden Lions. Curry Cup. Probably don't want to go back there. But uh, well, that's a massive drop-off. 100,000 down to 37. Man, salary caps, right? Queen's a country in the UR, the not the URC, in the NRC. Uh, 37,000, no thanks. Melbourne Rising, mm, no thanks. Sydney Race, mm, no thanks. Western Province, well, almost going back home, aren't we, in this point? But uh, more Curry Cup action there. And uh, Fiji and Drua in the NRC. Uh, C. I'm pretty sure we've already dominated the NRC, haven't we, of the Drua? So uh, it's a big no for that one. And that is it. That is our offers for Season 5 with Sam Lewis. Again, let me know your thoughts. Leave comments in the video. Leave comments um, or votes, I should say, in the community tab where we will have a poll of, I think, what will be the most wanted uh, team so far. But, of course, you can leave your say on there as well. I think the big teams we're going to look for here are the competitions we have not won. Scarlets, La Rochelle, Saints, definitely. Toulon, definitely. Cheetahs, maybe. Um, Sail Sharks, definitely. Uh, Zebra, definitely. And the Worcester Warriors, definitely as well as Connet, definitely as well. So a number of options. What's that? One, two, three, four, uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think nine really viable options. Uh, Scarlets are desperate. They are paying the most. But of course, it is up to you when Mr. Lewis goes in season number five. It has been an incredibly great, fun season four, but long season four as well. Let's make our way over to the Northern Hemisphere, maybe. Of course, if you want, we can stay in Super Rugby and dominate further here as well. That is it, though, from me today. A shorter video as we just take a little bit of a look, a little bit of a glimpse at who is interested in Mr. Sam Lewis. I'll be back. I'll give it a few days for you guys to decide and have your votes, and then we will kick in to season number five. Will it be Scarlets? Will it be La Rochelle? Or will it be teams like the Saints, Toulon, Cheetahs, Sharks, Zebri, Worcester, or Connet? So many good options for us to go to. Let me know your thoughts in, in the comments below, and of course, leave your vote. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series so far as well. It has been an absolute blast. And I'll see you all next time. Until then, thank you so much for watching. Leave your votes. And I'll see you for episode one of season five. Until then, take care.